Hello guys, it's GibbyCat. Once again, we're playing Craft of Survival Immortal, and this particular video, I'm actually going to show you guys how to get the tar right here. This is going to be uh, some of the ingredients that we need for making a lot of things, actually. Uh, I don't know if we can see it right here. I don't think we're on keel of doing that. Uh, it is actually operates on these things that we have all around. When you're operating this repair bench and so on, all of these things here are neat. Uh, one of these ingredients, and these particular ingredients are located at Gata Sawmill Sof itself. They're located in different kind of areas. You are always incapable of actually watching these areas here. What they have, this one right here, the tar. Are we talking about? It is in this area here as grow as well, and it is located in other direction as well. But this one right here, Gata Sawmill, is one of the best areas to actually get it. And I'm going to show you guys how to easily get your fingers on a lot of them. Now one of the upgrades that I need to make is my um, workbench here that is making these uh, beautiful right here these um, yeah bars and all these things here are actually um, needed right now in this one it is uh, needed 28 of these tars right here so I'm damn needed it. And you cannot get enough of them uh, when you're new at this game. They have made an update, and this update should make it easier to get more loot. So I'm looking forward to this. So this is the first uh, tr time actually trying this after this update. Now I want to show you guys a little thing before we go in uh, and do this. I'm uh, taking uh, axes with me, because in this area I'm also incapable of getting a lot of great wood here that I can make these legendary swords and that's the things you need. You don't need a shield, I'm just taking it because I had it on right now. So and I'm actually, oh, I, I always did it, sorry about that, but I actually took a lot of this. I didn't see I had these compressed one, uh, so I don't have enough space right now, but right now I'm just going to show you guys the pattern. There's two entries here uh, you want to go into, when you go to this area here, you can go around like this, when I get in to this area right here at this location, I normally just do this. I go in here, chop down this one right here. One more hit. There we go. And then there's a dog coming up in the top of the screen. But I will just go right here, this location here, not getting seen. And I will take all of this right here. This is uh, energy uh, for my, uh, yeah, everything is actually usable for me. This one right here is making energy for traveling, and all of these are useful for me. So if that's the items that I take in this particular run. Uh, now I need some water, that's pretty irritating actually. Uh, so let's just, I, I need to take some water guys. I don't want to die here. Oh first, that's a stupid thing. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, we have a little bit here, but I do think we're having free water. We always have free water in some kind of way. We go. Oh my god, that's too many. Okay, let's just try that with this one. Like that, okay. So now this dog right here is going back. When it's going back, you just sneak behind it. You don't need to fight it. You go in here slowly, like this. And you can chop down this guy here. Sometimes they attack, sometimes they don't. Like that. Oh my god, no. It's just uh, the dog coming at you. It's not normally like this I'm doing it, but it's because of that dog that is always attacking. Now in this area here we have some of the things you need. This one right here is definitely one of the things you want to take every time, this one. So you can go back and forth in these areas. I'm also going to show you guys this. And this area here, if you want to have some I love that these guys are just making the AI so that everything is just attacking. So now we can... Go like this. Now we need to kill all of these guys. Remember that. And remember, they are hitting in a pattern. You don't need to get hurt here. It's one of the things in this game that I do like that the AI is not changing. And I do hope that they will not change that in future. Uh, this one right here normally don't have anything, but uh, sometimes we have some water things in it. So I would just need that. Uh, but then I go inside of here, and we need to kill these one right here. It's going to be gonna get attacked with a lot of a lot of them. Once again, everything is a pattern, so we can just do like this. And come here, let her attack. 
that will like this. So now that's done. Yeah. And it's this one right here that's going to locate some of the tar actually. Now this is the first area where you can get the tar. I normally don't show you guys this one because this one is using more uh, time for actually getting it. So let's see, I think we got a little bit of water here. Perfect. Uh, so that's that's the first area with tar. You can go down here, try to get a lot of things here. I don't recommend it. Uh, just go out. Um, that's pretty much it in this area. So let's just go to the other area. Uh, I normally just take the trees with me here, just to be sure that I have enough. I really want to have that. Make sure that I get it. Remember, to st oh my god, not getting attacked by this dog. That's a very high. I think you don't want to be getting attacked by. Because it's going to lure a lot of them. Try to look at the uh, areas that I'm standing right now. It's very important you're not standing on the other side of this tree. Because otherwise these guys are going to attack you. As well as this one. It's this area here. You don't want to get attacked by the king right there. Uh, the boss or whatever you call it. And then you go down here. Slowly. Go to this one. Take it. Oh my god! The dog is coming again. Okay. And going down here. And taking this one, look at this now. Right now we're getting some of the items. This one right here is one of the items that we definitely need. And as you can see, in my inventory I do have enough. Uh, sorry, too much actually. And then you can sneak attack in this area. Go in the fog area. You can look it down at the minimap. You can go actually exactly out in this area. I, I just got attacked. Otherwise you can go into the top of that uh, screen and you can actually get it one more tree. So that's the only thing I need. Uh, but I don't need it right now. So let's just go to the other area so you guys can see as well where you can actually get it. Um, there's one thing here. We can go, go like this just a second. We'll still get lo uh, the same location. Remember that. Spawning at the same location. So... Let's just go to the other area. That's actually also a good area for getting the tar itself. So remember, if you need 28 tars, you need to travel back and forth in these areas here. And I do recommend that you actually use it. You can see I have 100, I actually had 200 uh, of energy for doing this. Uh, and I'm only having capacity for 100, but because the weekend they had a, a double up in energy, so that's actually giving me the energy without actually taking it back. That's a good thing. So, yeah, you guys might have tried that. It's going to be uh, sometimes in these uh, runs here you can get double up in that. So, let's see. Uh, we're going to do this just to get some water. It's pretty irritating, actually. That this area here, you just need to attack this one, and it's the third hit. You go at and kill her, so you don't need to actually lure these guys at at you. So at this point, you're gonna sneak again and do exactly the same things here. And the only thing I need in this area right now is just, uh, yeah, actually these things here. I normally just take these and then go out. Uh, if you wanna have uh, even more items, there's a lot of great items in this area. I'm just going to show you guys one thing. <clears throat> Sorry about that. In this area here, we're on cable actually getting a lot of chest here. And there's also uh, items like this one in this area. And of course, we can get a tree as well cut down. But we need to kill her for getting that. Yes. Remember, it's the third hit every time. And it is at this time you actually get attacked by the dog. Normally it comes in this area and this minute here. So, uh, but let's just go out and go back again. Show you guys the location. You can always look inside of uh, in the minimap what kind of items that you can get. Just tab on it. Looking at this one right here, it is having no tar. This is the new one. This one is not even ready. So looking at God of Summer here, we have great amount of tar here here we have nothing nothing so these are the location that I really recommend you try out but let's go back to the goddess uh, sawmill again because sometimes you actually spawn in different kind of areas so I do recommend that you actually try that more than once and of course using your energy at the right uh, point is very important now when you actually spawn in the top of the screen, you will be able actually 
getting even more tarred. And you are incapable of going back and forth in this area, in and out, just seeing if you spawn. Now we still spawn uh, like this one. This is the second uh, Goddess Salmo uh, uh, upgrade, uh, update, sorry. Uh, and this location here, there's two areas you want to go at. Uh, when you're incapable of actually spawning, when it's this map here, you're incapable of spawning in the bottom, like I did like right here, and you need to kill people, but you can also go out and actually end up spawning in the top of the screen, so I'll try to go in and out until I spawn that area. Uh, if I'm lucky enough, and it's already, we can sh I can show you guys it right this moment. I am that lucky, of course I am. So let's see, we're gonna kill this one right here, going at it slowly, hitting with a third hit. Like that, trying to hit this one a third hit when this one is gone. Like this second here. Here we go. Oh my god, now I get hit. Remember, just looking at the patterns, there's actually quite easily learnable. And of course, if there's any water and you need water, you need to like to look at these guys. Oh my god, I need water. That's so irritating. There we go. Uh, there's uh, normally I take this one right here because I just need to have some of this uh, glue on it. It is uh, some of the ingredients for making my uh, one and only legendary salt. It is a very powerful salt. This one right here, and need this one right here as resin in it, and it is uh, only inside of these. So, so now we can actually you don't need to kill more. Go down here, sneaking. Remember, you get attacked by a dog in this second, actually, normally. So then you go here. You don't need to kill all these guys. Just loot this main chest. It is actually the best chest here. And you can see this, this is the easiest pattern, actually, getting these items here. So I do recommend that you try that out, because uh, it's pretty fun. Now, normally, when I'm doing this, because I have enough energy and, uh, sorry, enough... Uh, uh, weapons and so on. I actually go down here. Take this one right here. This is the tree I want to have. And then I slowly go around here. I don't take that tree right there. That's going to be attacking me. But I can go down here once again. In this area. Now I get attacked. I need it like that. And then I can take this tree right here. And then I'm going up again and uh, attacking this one right here. I hope you guys can use these tips. Please write in description if you need any more tips, actually. Uh, so let's see. We're going to hit this one at third hit. Remember, it's third hit every time. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. I pressed the wrong button. Sorry about that. I'm just going... Going at, oh, okay, we got actually got to kill all these guys. That's easier. Let's protect it. Da, 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 da. I'm a little scared here, my friends. Oh my god. Do, do, do. Uh, it's not like going like that every time. You don't have to actually do the same pattern. What <laughs> is funny? Or you just fluff it up like that. Oh my god. Did you guys see I tap the collect button? Oh shit. Here we go, there's the baton in this little guy, and he's gonna die. Oh, mother freak of a monster. Perfect, now we got this one, that's a good thing. And more of these, I'm actually looting only those items here because I can use them. I can reuse them in some kind of way. Okay, let's see here. Okay, now you can see what we actually get here. I, I didn't want to do that, actually, but it is okay. Uh, this one is, uh, you need a Berkeley uh, update for that right now my in mine is actually not that high i'm still struggling my way out of this uh, i don't know about you guys but i'm actually using a lot of time trying to get this one right here this one is level five right now and i'm not even incapable of getting this one you can see i have a lot of them actually in my inventory right here so let's just loot this what i want to show you guys is this one right here now normally you can loot this one without getting attacked by these guys if you tap the right button and here we go. And then we go to this area here. I'm gonna take this one. I don't go down in the dungeon. I don't need to do that. It is not necessarily something I really want to do. So normally I take this one. You can see I get a lot of these locks here. I should get just one more of these uh, 
Thanks for making my sword here. Normally in these runs, yeah, here we go. Normally in this run, I have to, uh, about three to six of these. So now I'm capable of actually making one of my legendary sword right now because I have that. And I have enough of this as planks here. It is all of these items here. You can see right here. So now I just need some of the iron uh, that are uh, also collectible in this area. You can actually loot everything for making a uh, legendary salt in this area. Hope you guys enjoyed this. I know this is just for a simple run. I got four of them right now. Now the thing I can just recommend you guys doing is going back and forth, back and forth in these particular areas. There are located two more tars in this area. Uh, I don't want to show you guys where that is because I don't actually necessarily need to actually uh, go to that area. That once again, meaning that you need to fight these guys. But I do recommend that you just travel to this area. 30 energy points for doing that is simply not much. And these things are actually easily lootable uh, to get some of these things here. And the things I'm talking about is this one, uh, grinder seat and beam seat and of course uh, the wheat seat itself. You can use that for making a lot of great things like for example energy potion and this one right here. And the energy potion is used for traveling. This one right here is actually 210 in, in, uh, yeah, in, in, in healing. So that's pretty much some of the best thing you can get actually. This is easy. This is taking me no time. I'm just talking my way out of it. I've been doing it right now the second time I go into this area and second time I've been at Gata Summer in less than 20 minutes and getting beautiful items here and for you guys that need the tar it is the easiest way to get the tar uh, at its highest amount there's higher level of course but if you're a low level like I am right now you're incapable of doing it look at my level here and I am a high level actually uh, 65 it's been a long time since I was playing this because I was a little bit irritated about the updates uh, some of the updates made it, uh, yeah, more easy for new new guys for actually uh, looting as much as I did. I used a huge amount of time in the first step of this particular game, and that was pretty irritating. That they just made everything easier, and you can buy your way out of. I hate when you're incapable of ending up buying XP. XP is one of the most important thing in a survival game. XP is meant for those who really want to go into a game. And trust me, I can just recommend different kind of games. Western Survival, for example. Western Survival is also a survival game. And this particular game, I have played it for three freaking years, man. And I'm not, I am, I'm, I will say I'm a pro at that game, but I am definitely loving the idea that you need to gather everything. Now we just spawn in the bottom of the uh, screen here and gather some in this one. Now I just want to show you the right way to do this one. Because there's actually some uh, ingredients you can use here. So let's just see here. You go like this, kill this guy, third hit, if you can do it. One of those stress. No, you cannot. And now I just need to kill everyone again, my friend. Why are you doing this? Oh, it's going a little bit fast, but I can't do it. Just one blast. Hopefully, this dude will die. Oh my god, I just tapped the wrong one. Oh my god, a shield needs. Okay, it's only because I have the shield right now I'm using it, so. Here we go. Now, normally you don't need to kill all of these guys. I said that every time. But I'm just gonna show you guys this one right here. So if you had hit that guy correctly, oh my god, I'm freaking stupid at this. And uh, then you're going slowly up here. <laughs> and you are actually incapable of killing this one with one hit. Like that, and then you can take this one. That's what I just wanted to show you guys. Now I'm actually going to show you guys the other location of the tower. I can just do that because I killed seriously everything in this area now. Uh, let's just uh, one of those of these. Let's do it, guys. We're gonna do it. Okay, so this is the area that I want to show you guys where you can get some extra tar, of course, so you can get the full amount of tar. Now I recommend you just go like this, kill this one, and then you can sneak here, taking this one out before this king is going to annoy you. Oh my god. It's a good thing I got all my healing here because I'm really fluffing it up right now. Perfect. So let's see. 
This one right here, half of course, this one. So that's a good thing. Good collectible items. And now let's see here. We start off with this one right here. This one has uh, some of the beans in it. No, it's not this one, sorry. Here we go. It's the other chest that have, have the tar. Here is the bean, uh, bean soup. So you can actually see how much I have right now. And I can't remember how much I had when we started out. I think it was about 12. Now, this one right here have the tar. So, oh my god, I don't have the tar. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna, sorry guys. We're gonna go down the dungeon now. Just to show you guys what's inside of the dungeon. So you guys can get the full amount of stupidity that I just learned, you guys. But you are getting, uh, I hope you guys learned a little thing here. Um, yeah, you can actually fluff it up like I do many times. And I know a lot of the YouTubers are actually just saying, oh, it's so easy doing this, but they have tried the patents billions of times. I don't want to do this one. This is stupid. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this. See you guys next time. I'm Cubbycat, and this is the way you get tar. And, of course, yeah, a lot of uh, orc tree as well. As, and items for making the legendary sword. Very important thing. There's a little tree right here. And, of course, we're in Kayla taking it so that will be still not doing it there we go six that's three legendary swords i'm incapable of making right now and maybe we can get a little more here there's also cold in this area and there's uh granite and there's a lot of things so now i just want to travel back here uh and i normally like i said and oh you can see i have 143 uh, smaggers of energy I could go back and forth, back and forth like that. Uh, four, I actually need four more tar, uh, tars, so I definitely need to do it some more times. So I'll just do that myself and hope you guys enjoy this. Have fun, guys. This is uh, just a game, remember that. But it's actually a funny game, and it is a game that's giving you a pattern in getting the tar as easy as possible. And right now, I just fluff it up because I actually forgot going back in and out just to do... Uh, the tar run in this area. Oh my god. So, hope you guys learned of my mistake. See you guys next time, guys. Bye.